The size of it is massive. So I had to ask the question, what if you fell in? It wouldn't be too good. I reckon I'm gonna spend some money. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Tattoos by Colin. We've got some really cool stuff to show you today. We have been invited to the Bundaberg Distillery here in Queensland to do a bit of a walkthrough and a bit of behind the scenes. So we're extremely fortunate to be able to have this and shoot this for you. So stay tuned. disclaimer time guys on this channel we get up to some pretty crazy things now they are for entertainment purposes only and all these stunts we get up to are under strict professional supervision under no circumstances is Bundaberg represented by us or us by Bundaberg we've just been really fortunate and we're very honored for them to allow us to come through and have a look at some of the backstage stuff here so come and check it out it's uh it's going to be a great day The beautiful thing about this distillery is they have put Bundaberg on the map. Not only do they grow some of the best sugar cane in Australia, they also do some of the best rum. The rich red volcanic soil that the sugar cane is grown in is what gives Bundaberg rum its unique taste. Now this is the iconic Bundaberg rum logo. Standing next to it is absolutely incredible. The size of it is massive. He's been around since 1961, and you may have seen him in a few commercials over the years. <laughs> this awesome icon was also used to show the cool estates here in Australia. The Bundy was used to warm you up during those real cold times. And let's face it, the polar bear they do all right in the cold, don't they? I think they've cracked the code for the perfect one. Got so much weight on my shoulders And you have to knock me out But I'm still holding the throne You never know till it's over It is so fascinating to see some of the original bottles and where they started out and the change of design over you know a long period of time over generations and this isn't just a rum these are on a world scale which we're about to show you down this end because uh, i was even blown away with some of the accomplishments that bundaberg has achieved over the years come and check out these ones here these are what I've learned is not only Bundaberg is Australia's favourite rum, they've won world's best rum. Shown here, which is fantastic. Not only the world's best rum, world's best dark rum, world's best gold rum. I wish I could be the world's best tattooers, but you got to start somewhere. they got a lot more years on me. So it's really fascinating to see Bundaberg started in such a small town, and now they're the biggest and best on the world's global scale. Hello? Yeah, we just want to come and have a look through your uh, distillery if that's okay, guys. Wow, this is beyond incredible. It's a shame you can't smell what we're smelling here because it is just so rich and it's very, very pleasant. We've been told they have 5,000 tonnes worth of molasses here and they actually keep up to 15,000 tonnes on site at all times. And the reason behind this is because they only produce the sugar cane up six months of the year. Now, obviously, they need to produce Bundaberg rum for up to 12 months of the year, so we don't want people going without and neither do these guys. And um, this is just absolutely incredible. Just to be standing here is an absolute privilege. Yeah, it's, it's mind-blowing how big this place is. We actually have been told 
that this holds up to five meters in height and you'll see the markers on those uh, on the beams there so we're actually down to one meter at the moment so i had to ask the question what if you fell in Whew, it wouldn't be too good i've been told no one's ever gone in there but the consistency of this would almost be like quicksand like treacle they do have a lot of safety precautions here and that's why we have to be very careful and uh, be under absolute professional guidance. Oh, mate, they even have karaoke. <laughs> Yeah, they are. You wouldn't believe. Look at this. We actually get to walk on it. It feels so. be your bartender for today be sure to click on the link below and you can actually have your own personalized tour of Bundaberg as well they do tours for the public very regularly um, and I highly recommend it it's definitely one of the best things we've done to date so far so get yourself onto it book yourself a tour and not only that people aren't aware of you can buy special mixes and blends and liqueurs that you can't buy anywhere else get onto it, a little secret for you guys, all right? Oh, that's too heavy, I was gonna take one home with me. <laughs> These guys also have a blend your own rum experience. I've been told you can choose from all these different barrels. I won't go through all the details, but what they tell me, you can make your own rum, and no, they don't just give you one bottle to take, they give you two. And the reason behind that, if you had one, you probably wouldn't drink it. So <laughs> they give you two, you can drink it, and if you like your own blend, they keep it on file here, so you can actually just call up or get online and order more of your own blend. So imagine that, having your very own blend of Bundaberg rum in your own bar to impress your friends with. I reckon I'll be getting me some of that. Just finished the walkthrough of the distillery, now comes the exciting part. Now I've learned so much about Bundaberg and how they hold themselves on such a world scale, I'm excited to get into the store over there. So we've got a few minutes to wait, uh, but I reckon I'm going to spend some money. Chuck these in the freezer. Enjoy your beautiful rum, ice cold. I got my little minions help me out too. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Tattoos by Colin, Instagram and YouTube. Tattoos by Colin, all one word.